Macmillan had started it, but then he was Ed Macmillan, but he was called away uh, for war work on, on radar at, uh, at MIT. Uh, we made our, after I'd asked my graduate student, Arthur Wall, to become very expert in the chemistry of element 93, which had been discovered by Macmillan and Abelson, but which, had, which work had not led to the discovery of element 94, we made our first deuteron bombardment of uranium on December 14, 1940. And then the chemical separations were made. And, uh, and alpha, it's getting a little technical now, but an alpha particle emitting daughter of element 93 was found. We suspect that that was due to element 94. And on, the, on February 23, 1941, we were able to prove through chemical techniques that it was uh, the alpha emitter was uh, due to the new element with the atomic number 94. It was in Gilman Hall, room 307. It was a stormy night. Um, uh, Art Wall was performing the, uh, my graduate student, my first graduate student, uh, was performing the uh, oxidation experiment and uh, it uh, just uh, uh, was uh, uh, clear that we were able to oxidize uh, this new alpha particle emitter for the first time uh, under conditions uh, uh, that no other known element uh, would be oxidized and, uh, in that way. And uh, so that this led to the discovery, and uh, that was exciting.